I worked on a uh, one of these go karts here, and this particular model actually runs a uh, DC powered system. Um, a lot of times these will have a little bit bigger CDI box than than your regular AC system. Uh, you'll also notice the black and red wire is not actually hooked up. The black and white red wire runs an AC system. Um, this CD I box is actually powered by 12 volts, which is this black wire right here. This is a 12 volt wire run to this. Um, so what happens is we still have our trigger wire, which is on this one, it's uh, blue and yellow. Uh, this this came to me and some of the wires were chopped up, so I, I directly did it. Normally it'll run up through the foot pedal. Um, but anyway, uh, so this is our trigger. It gets 12 volts automatically, so this is CDI, the condensers in here, uh, capacitors are always uh, charged up. And then when it trigger wire comes through, which is about one volt, uh, it sends the spark um, to, the, to the coil pack, and then you get your spark. So on this particular system, you're going to have your trigger, which is blue and white. Uh, and that, if you're looking at this plug, is the top left uh, prong right directly underneath that would be a green so that would be your bottom left and your coil on this one is your top right so it would actually be uh, the top right one inside that plug this one's 12 volts I want to say on this wiring diagram if you have another wire in there uh, and somebody's messed with the wires on this. I think this one right here is a kill switch. I'd have to double check. Um, so you should get about a hundred if you ohm this out your blue and white wire to the ground. You should get about 150 ohms around there. Uh, and when you crank it over, AC bolt should be about up to one volt or so. Um, green, ohm it out. It should ohm zero. And uh, black and yellow uh i'm not sure what the coils are omen i think they're about 250 or something like that but uh anyway that that's that your black and red wire on this particular one is not hooked up